Hi everyone and in this video we are gonna read PDF data into a uh, text uh, so we will learn how to convert a PDF file into a text file using Python so let's get started with that so first of all we need a module known as PyPDF2 so if you don't have that make sure to open your PyCharm, IntelliJ whatever you're using and install this library so in PyCharm or IntelliJ you can go to project structures so uh, let me see where it is project structures make sure you have the latest version of python that is python 3.7 go to packages and let it load it takes a while of course because i have a lot of libraries you go to plus icon and type the name that's it and you need to install it so i have already done that so i'm not gonna do that again okay so first of all i create an object known as uh, pdf file obj or it can be anything a b c then open then i pass in the path of that file which is right here so let me open the pdf file and show you so basically this file has a short stories a list of stories basically here you can see the gift of the maggie so let me uh okay so so i so i have provided the path of the file and i want to read that file as a read byte so i'm going to read it okay then pdf reader equals to pdf2 that is the library name dot pdf file reader and i'm creating an object known as pdf reader i'm creating a blank text known as my text then for page num in range pdf reader dot number of pages so it will iterate through number of pages on the pdf file page object is equal to pdf reader dot get page and get page num so basically what it does basically whatever it, it gives the page number to that object and whatever string it will convert that into a text and i'm appending in my my text so let me run this and show you whether it works it takes a while because it's gonna read the entire pdf and convert it into a text file so it takes a bit time so here you see uh, the entire pdf has been converted into a text file now how about i make i'm making an audio reader so how do i can uh, make a text to speech from that so simple uh, you can use is from gtts on a mac os import gtts so i'm gonna convert this into a audio file so i can listen on my phone or you know on my laptop of course so i say story.mp3 save this as a so basically this uh, function what it does is basically read the entire pdf and then convert it into a text file uh, i mean a string of course and then i am uh, converting that string into an audio so let's see how it works this will take a while so be patient so right now it's loading it might take about a minute or two because it's a huge pdf file it's going to read the entire pdf and then convert it into a mb3 file so uh, be patient with that so it's still uh, you know reading uh, the process is going on so let's wait for a while and um, you know i can i can terminate it so i will get a partial audio not the com complete one but uh, let's prefer like waiting for like about 20, 10 to 20 seconds at least and so we can get the data uh, on the mp3 file remember the name of the mp3 file was story.mp3 okay so let me disconnect it because it's gonna take a long time you know i mean I'll, not that to, that long but it, it will take a little while and i want to keep my youtube video short short and sweet so if you see story.mb3 short stories from 100 selected stories by o henry the gift of the magi a cosmopolitan a cafe right, between so. smiles with sniffles predominating her hat off and let's have a sight at the looks of it down rippled the brown cascade all Twenty dollars, right. said Matt. So that's it for this video, and I see you guys next hand. time. Let me just oh, close Henry, that for a while. selected stories. Quit. So that's it. How you convert a PDF into an audio file? So you can make a UI, you can make a GUI out of it. It's pretty simple. You can use TK Inter, PyQt. It's up to you. So that's it for uh, this video. The, the code is already there on my GitHub account. If not, then do remind me because I usually forget to upload on my GitHub. So if you have any questions suggestions let me know and i shall see you in the next video thank you so much